Hi everyone, it's Anna. I'm back again today with another thrift haul. Um, this is a haul from a day when I went thrifting right after work, so I really didn't have that much time to really look through everything the way I would usually like to. I'm usually in the thrift hour, thrift hour. <laughs> I'm usually in the thrift store for like at least three hours if I really want to be able to look through everything well. And so on days when I get off work, I only have like what? An hour and a half, two hours, because it takes time to get there, duh. Yeah, so maybe like two hours. Um, so I was really rushing, but I found some really, really great stuff that I'm like obsessed with now. So I guess I can quickly mention what's on my lip just because I usually do. I all the way lined my lips like and filled in my lips with NYX in Dolly Pink. So it's just a pink color. And then I went in on top with this, what is this? Rimmel, it's the Moisture Renew. It's in the color 120 Coral Shimmer. It's an old one, so I don't know. It's just a shimmery coral. And then I like blotted it off with like a paper towel or whatever, that like, I don't know, old school black trick thing to kind of take off some of it because it was still really, really pink. And then I went on top of it with um, the Kat Von D. This is little baby version of it, but it's the Kat Von D. Which color is this? I think it's Forever in Love or something like that. It's like a shimmery goldish brown color. This is the little baby. <laughs> and so I went on top of it with All right, so starting with non-clothing items first, like I usually do, the first thing I found, oh, I'm in love with, it is just this little Hello Kitty mug. I'm obsessed with Hello Kitty. I remember when I was younger, it was like a treat on like our birthdays to be able to go to the Sanrio store and just get kind of whatever we wanted from the Hello Kitty store because it was expensive, so we could only really get it on our birthdays. And so it was like a treat, so. Got this, it matches my little mouse pad, so I'm just gonna keep this on my desk and maybe hold like pens or something, but I thought he was super cute. Um, and I only paid it two dollars for little Miss Hello Kitty. Then I'm obsessed with Sperry's, like the boat shoes, and I found this awesome pair of this black, kind of shimmery looking, I just burped. Shimmery looking Sperry's. Um, so excited to find these. I don't think they really fit me too well. I tried them on without socks though, so I think they're a little too big. These are a size 7. I think with the Sperry's I usually try to get a 6.5. So these are a little bit snug, but they were only $10. So for Sperry's, $10, and they still look so brand new on the bottom. Uh, yeah, I wasn't leaving them there. So I had to get these. Love them. Yes. So starting on to the clothes, didn't really find that much, but I found this great peplum top. It is just this navy blue peplum top. So, so cute. Oh man, I just realized it's got like a little teeny tiny bit of a floral detail. I know it's not going to pick up on camera, but it's there. That's so weird. I didn't even know that. Cute. So just navy blue. It is by Banana Republic. And when I picked it up, I really didn't think it was going to fit, but I was lucky that it did. And it just zips closed all the way in the back. And I got this one for $4. Okay, and then I got some more J. Crew. I got another button up top. This is just this really, really pretty, like green. Is this a pinstripe? I don't know, but just green striped J. Crew. It's just a plain button up. Um, let me see. It is the sm Slim Fit, which is basically, I have so many of these, but a lot of times I just end up sleeping in them. Um, just because I obviously love J. Crew and I love the button ups, but sometimes I just don't really like how they look on me. But this one's a really, really nice material. It's like kind of softy. So I think this is definitely one that I'll be wearing to work. So I'm in love. And I only paid $4 for another J. Crew button up. I love my velour. That's the, I think that's what it's called. I love the velour, the velvety material. Found a cardigan that is a velour and I'm so happy. It is just this like whiny color like is this a maroon oh my gosh what is wrong good thing it's back to school time maybe i should be going back to school but it's just this really pretty like wine color velour cardigan and then i love the detail that it has all the way around it it's like in beat and it's embroidered it's like embroidered all the way around and like beaded it is so pretty it literally goes all the way around the edges, so all the way around the edge there. Super thick, like in the front right there, and then all along the bottom. And then it's also embroidered on the sleeves, which I thought was really, really pretty. 
It is by Coldwater Creek. It is so pretty. It is so soft. I love Allure. And I only paid $4 for this guy. So excited to wear this to work. But I don't want to think about it now because it's like literally 90 degrees outside. It is disgusting hot outside. Luckily, not indoors. <laughs> Next, I found two dresses that I think are super cute. I'm not really sure if I'm going to keep them for myself because I'm, uh, I just don't know if I really love them on me, but I love them in general. So the first one is just, oh, it's open. This beautiful like green dress and it's got this like purple embroidered flowers all the way around it. It is so, so cute. The only reason I don't love it on me is because I do have a bigger chest. <laughs> like how I say bigger, it's a big chest. So, oh, what was that? So, anyways, um, I just don't, am not a fan of really how this, like, cuts my chest off, like, right in the middle instead of this line being right underneath my chest. Um, but I think this is a beautiful dress. It is by Ann Taylor, and it's got just those, like, embroidered flowers all the way down it, and then it's super thick design on the bottom which I think is really really pretty let me not get my lipstick on this and then it's just got like a cutout little slit in the back just like that but what is super amazing about this dress is it is 100% silk oh so 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 pretty it and everyone whenever I try it on and I let people see it on me they're like oh my god and I love the dress but it's just they don't understand the problems with the chest area that this is just it ain't cute not it but I only paid six dollars for this 100% silk and tailor six dollars yes. so I can leave it there obviously but I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it yet nah. and then I found another dress that I tried to try on at the store but I literally got stuck in it like my head was stuck in it <laughs> and then it had my makeup on so my makeup got all on the inside of the dress so I'm like good thing mi madre was here to clean it up because I had makeup smeared all on the inside unfortunately but it is just this really 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 cute like is this like a pale what is this kind of green color like it's like a yellowish green color it's like a double layered dress it is so so cute. It reminds me of like the double layered style that like Kim Kardashian wore a few times I think. But I love it. So it's just like a double layered thing. It's connected. And this is what it looks like in the back. It's kind of got like this cute button up. Um, and it's even layered like on the back which I think is great. Um, but it's connected still. Like at the arms. But see like even the dress though goes all the way up and then this material just kind of sits on top. It kind of hits me, I think, like below the knee if it would fit. But the like, the fit of this dress is so cute. I wish I could have gotten it on my body. I'm just like, uh. So I'm not sure if I'm going to include this on in like the try on. I'm not sure if I'll be able to show it on me. But this dress was so, so, so cute. And it's only $6. It's by Ann Taylor. Looks like an older Ann Taylor, kind of like the label on it and I guess the style um but it was only six dollars it's so cute it's in great condition so I obviously bought it yeah next I found something that I'm so so happy about I almost didn't buy it but then my friend was like um Anna are you crazy you're gonna buy that so it is just this tank top that I have in this bag to protect it so that it doesn't get dirty <laughs> But it's just, and now I'm scared to touch it actually. My hands are probably gonna get dirty. Thank God it is inside out. It's inside out right now just because I'm scared to like touch the inside because I don't wanna make get it dirty. But it's just this cream crop, not crop top. It's just this cream tank top. So cute. But the thing about this shirt, besides the fact that it still has these little tags on it, which is why I'm trying to protect it too, it still has the tags on it. This the first thing that caught my eye was really that it had the tag, but then I looked at the tag. This is from Barney's New York, is where this tag is from. doesn't have the price on it, though. And the brand of this shirt is actually an Alexander Wang. So it still has the Alexander Wang tags on it, if it's showing. Is showing this good? So it has the Alexander Wang tags on it. I'm not sure how much this shirt costs 
in real life. If I Google it, I will put it in here. But this was like, oh, pick me, take me home, is what this shirt was saying to me. So, yeah, that's crazy. This was only $4. Still has the tags on it from Barney's. Ridiculous. Who didn't even wear this? Why? Why? It's cute. It's just a tank top. I think it's so funny how I put all these clothes in like plastic bags. <laughs> Gotta protect it. Okay. Lastly is another jacket. I know it's disgusting hot outside. It is summer and I'm buying jackets. But now is the best time to buy the jackets because everyone, no one's looking at them. So you're going to get the best pick, right? Because no one else is thinking about jackets. It's nasty out. So found this jacket. I'm in love. It kind of looks like one that I bought before, but there's a little bit of difference to it. It is just, it is this black jacket, just like this. I'm in love. It is like another, is this suede? I love it. What is this material? It's like a suede -ish. It's not really suede, but it's supposed to kind of look like that, right? I have no idea. But I am in love. It is such a great fit. Literally, I believe this jacket was literally waiting there for me. For me. Um, my friend almost talked me out of not getting it, but I knew if I had left there without this jacket, I would forever be haunted by the memory of this jacket on me. I love it. It's kind of similar to um, like a tannish one that I got a while ago. It is all the way lined with faux fur. And besides the fact that it is black instead of that like tan or that like creamy color, it doesn't have a hood. So I'm fine with that. I actually like how it fits with this nice little collar on. And then I love how folded over you can kind of see some of the faux fur poke through out of it. And again, it's by the same brand of the one that I got before. It is by Ann Taylor. I am obsessed with these jackets. I think it is so cute. This one, it just fits me a little more slim though than the other one does. It fits me more like a blazer, I guess I could say. Yeah, more like a little blazer. Um, but I'm so obsessed. And I only paid $10 for this jacket again. Ten Jackets are usually $10, so couldn't be happier with this. I'm going to be styling when it gets cold out, but I don't want to think about that. So that is everything for this thrift haul. Like I said, we really ran through there so quickly because they were about to close. It was right after work. And yes, I did find all this stuff at the thrift store. Sometimes I just really think people are lying about it. I'm just like, there's no way, girl, that you found that all the way Gucci purse at Goodwill. But... Sometimes I amaze myself seriously with some of the stuff that I find. I cannot say this enough. Try thrift stores. Try thrifting. Try it, try it, try it, try it, try it. You'll be so happy you did probably. So, yeah. That is everything that I found for this haul. Um, thank you so much to everyone who has been commenting on my video still. I definitely appreciate it. And I try to get back and comment to everyone. I try. So, please, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, there is something on my nose. I don't know what that was. Please subscribe to my channel. Please like this video if you liked it and stay tuned for more thrift hauls. I will definitely try to make more time to do some more thrifted lookbooks because I have so many, so many stuffs, so much stuff that I would love to try outfits with. So I'm really excited for that. So yeah, thank you so much for sticking with me. Thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye.